Hi, today we will have a look at this. Yes, it is an empty drum from uh, Betamax or Umatic video cassette recorder. But no, it is just the stand. The interesting bit is this. So, what do you think it is? What's your guess? Yes, it is an infrared seeker aid from the decommissioned Soviet Strela 2 missile. I found it on uh, German eBay for 30 euros a few years ago. It was a very good deal. It came from uh, Poland, so probably from the stock of decommissioned missiles from the Polish army. It has been neutralized, you can see in fact. There is no screw or anything you can take apart on this, and it has been cut here. Uh, actually, this is uh, fiber-ish, bakelite-ish uh, piece. It was cut here, but normally you should have here a stack of circuit boards with uh, guidance electronics of my side. You can see here we have remains of three cut screws. And uh, just some wires. So I cannot open it at all because, in fact, there is a gap here. So I guess this front lance piece is glued on here. But uh, it is a collector piece, and really, I do not want to damage it. So there is not much I can do. Except I can show you a tent. It is a US patent, but I believe we have a very similar setup. So it is an infrared seeker with one cast grain lance, probably made of germanium. In fact, not sure because germanium is transparent to infrared. And here you want to reflect infrared on the mirrors, so maybe not. So we have a set of cast grain lamps, the first one, so there is your front window. First lance is here, it is a round mirror, annular mirror even. It will reflect here on another mirror. And it will concentrate your infrareds on your sensor here. In here it is a lead uh, sulfur sensor. I believe. And this wall mirror assembly you can see floating around in here is gyro stabilized with a gyroscope wheel in here. So I guess this is very similar to what we have here. So I will try to zoom in for you in order to show you a little bit more. So you can see we have this part floating around. There is an annular mirror. There is the front piece here, which is black here. We cannot see much. With a lot of little set screw to adjust balance, probably. And yes, it is going into another mirror in here and then going to your sensor deep inside. So this is fairly easy, heavy, so there must be the gyro wheel here in the you can see in the thickness of the annular lens, I guess you have your gyroscope wheel. At the back, the remains of... Uh, so, a dozen of wires here. And a coax wire here with this little box. Which you can see it is coming from the middle, so it is where you should have your uh, sensor, so it is probably the output of the sensor. So in fact all of what the missile does, it is seeking for the hottest point, so this is zero stabilized, so it will uh, look straight in front of the missile, and the missile will guide itself in order to find the hottest point you can, you can uh, find and uh, try to keep focus on it. So of course it is a completely inert piece 
quite collectible but sadly I cannot take it apart further any any further because of this uh, glued on piece so in here we probably have some kind of an adjustment is in this uh, shielded can so you can see uh, it is really very nice uh, quality here of construction of course it is sad I have not uh, I am missing the complete electronics pack it should be have been nice to have it but in fact it should have been enclosed in the same tube here so maybe you, uh, you will not be have been able to have a look at the electronics without cutting this uh, tube actually okay it is quite uh, EV piece I have a, maybe a dead code in here of 1977 not sure but here is by the way what you might have in here or something very similar patent number 4999491 if you want to have a look at it so thanks for watching bye bye